Thanks for the kind words. Typically when people uh, hear the background, they just kind of say, oh, he's a weirdo, uh, is what the response is. So I'm kind of, I'm, I'm used to that, and it's okay. Uh, but uh, uh, but think of kind words nonetheless. Uh, I would like to recognize our family and friends who have joined us. My mom in Illinois on live stream, Betsy's parents, John and Betty, thanks for coming and joining us right here, who uh, took the opportunity to do some business up here and have her out. So, just really appreciative uh, that uh, <laughs> you might be able to envision what was similar to this <laughs> or maybe not. All right, but uh, no, it's a great spot to be on. Team Gildan's honored to serve once again at Fort Hood. We're excited and we're proud to be here in Central Texas. The support of the surrounding communities is incredible. I look forward to working alongside all of you as we support our soldiers, families, civilian workers who live in, go to school, and work in your communities, both, <clears throat> both on and off post. In our short time back, we have seen a lot of great things happening, both here on Fort Hood and off. Our nation's been when it called upon. Again, I just want to say thanks from Betsy and I to all of you who have attended today. They say there's a cake inside, so please come in and help yourself. Have dessert before dinner. But for those of you who are willing to take the risk, like myself, have dessert twice tonight. All right. It's great to have you here. It's going to be great, uh, great uh, time that we will absolutely get to know folks and enjoy it together. Family people, go Army. G-I-L-L-A-N-G. Is that good? Okay. Uh, as we talk about challenges, first of all, it's just great to be here at, uh, at Fort Hood. It's an opportunity for us. We've returned uh, after six years of being away. Uh, I think that you know, we've got cha the challenges that exist here uh, also exist across the Army. Uh, as we talk about uh, you know, making sure that the CG's number one priority, people, uh, and that's what we do in the United States Army. People is what makes our Army go. Uh, regardless of any of the equipment that's out there, we're based upon people and we've got to make sure people are ready to train and educated in their respective job sets and able to go perform their jobs uh, when, when called upon. The people is the number one priority, but uh, what we've also got going on with uh, across uh, the third corps is modernization 
Uh, obviously, training readiness as we improve our training uh, in order to go to places like the National Training Center, which is our combat training center out of Puerto Rico, California. Uh, and, and then uh, any other missions that the Army uh, determines will be assigned to Fort Hood and our subordinate units within on Fort Hood and within 3 Corps. Because uh, this position as the Deputy Commanding General is not just the Deputy Commanding General here at Fort Hood, it's Fort Four, of which we've got multiple units uh, and installations that are subordinate to the 3 Corps. As you know, four divisions, separate brigades at, uh, at various installations around the nation. Conversation with him are words of wisdom, uh, particularly as he just assumed command of the 1st Cavalry Division yesterday. I mean, you know, we've, we've both got over 30 years of experience. Uh, and, and he gave me, you know, what he's been doing for the past uh, year here as the Deputy Commanding General. And I, and I hope to build upon that uh, as we support Lieutenant General White's uh, priorities and, and achieve his end points. Thanks everybody for coming and joining us. Really appreciate it. Uh, it's uh, it's great to be here at Three Core. I mean, think about it. I mean, it, it's pretty cool standing in front of this. You know what I mean? And uh, and you know, the almost 90,000 soldiers that are across our core, uh, and the opportunity to serve them, their families, and of course our uh, great army civilians. So again, thanks for coming. Get in line and get some cake. Have a great day. All right.